Hey guys, this is Damien from Dame Tech back with another video. Since some of you request that I test the new iPad Air 4 and compare against the latest iPad Pro, I decided to purchase this device and test for you all. Again, as I said before, all of these devices that you see in these videos I purchased with my own money. So if you enjoy these videos, please subscribe to help this channel. I would greatly appreciate this. Nevertheless, I am excited to test the latest iPad Air, especially since in my line of work as a marriage and family therapist, I basically do all of my work on a tablet platform. From taking notes in session, billing insurance, creating therapy materials for clients, telehealth, media production, the list goes on and on. Tablets are my preferred working device, especially due to the portability and ease. Nevertheless, I hope this video is informative for those of you who are trying to decide which tablet to purchase as it pertains to performance. Especially since only the iPad Pro 12.9 inch will be receiving an upgrade this year according to current leaks. Hence, if you're looking for a smaller form factor without sacrificing performance, both of these devices will probably be on your wish list. Therefore, in this video, we will be unraveling the truth behind which device is better in regards to productivity and or gaming. I've decided to do a series of benchmark tests. I will conduct these tests through first doing a 3D Mark wildlife stress test to see how each device performs under long periods of gaming or graphical work. Second, I will follow up with the 3D Mark Wildlife Unlimited test to measure each device's ability to handle high levels of graphical performance in short periods. Last, I'll then do a test using Geekbench 5 to test and analyze the power of each device's CPU. Please be on the lookout for the part two of this iPad comparison, as I'll be using Genshin Impact and PUBG as an additional performance measurement tool for those of you looking to use these devices for gaming. I'll also be purchasing and reviewing the upcoming Samsung S21 phone that will be releasing in the next few weeks. With that being said, please enjoy this video, subscribe, and take care.